China's railways have captured the world's attention for their impressive speed, size, and efficiency. In just a few short decades, China has managed to build the largest high-speed rail network in the world, with more than 42,000 kilometers of track connecting its major cities and regions. What's even more impressive is the speed at which China has accomplished this feat, with many projects completed in just a fraction of the time it would take in other countries. How did China manage to build such a vast and modern railway network so quickly and efficiently? Here are the reasons. Number 1. Government Support The Chinese government has provided significant support for the development of the country's railway network through investment in infrastructure projects and subsidies for companies involved in building railways. According to the National Bureau of Statistics of China, the government invested over 800 billion yuan, approximately $123 billion, in railway construction in 2020. This investment has helped to fuel the rapid expansion of China's railway network, which now spans over 150,000 kilometers, including more than 42,000 kilometers of high-speed rail lines. In contrast, the United States did not have a high-speed rail network comparable to those found in countries like China. It is worth noting that the United States has a vast network of freight railroads that transport goods across the country. According to the Association of American Railroads, there were over 225,000 kilometers of freight rail track in the United States as of 2021. The U.S. federal government has historically provided relatively little funding for railway infrastructure, leaving most investment to private companies. Number 2. Large-scale and efficient construction. Chinese construction companies are known for their ability to build large-scale projects quickly and efficiently. This is partly due to the country's vast population and large workforce, as well as its experience in building large infrastructure projects like the Three Gorges Dam. In terms of speed, China has set several records for building railways. For example, it built a 1,318 km HSR line between Beijing and Shanghai in just four years, and completed a 1,435 km HSR line between Lanzhou and Urumqi in just three years. These projects involved significant coordination and planning, and the use of advanced construction techniques like precast concrete segments, which allowed for more rapid and efficient construction. By comparison, railway construction in many other countries can be slow and complex. For example, the construction of a high-speed rail line in California, which has been beset by delays and cost overruns, has been ongoing for over a decade. Number 3. Use of Advanced Technology China has invested heavily in developing and using advanced technology in its railway construction projects. For example, it has developed high-speed trains that can travel at speeds of up to 350 km per hour, and has implemented advanced signaling and communication systems to improve safety and efficiency. China's HSR system is now the largest in the world, with over 42,000 km of track in operation. Its trains are capable of reaching speeds of up to 350 km per hour, making them some of the fastest in the world. The HSR system is also equipped with advanced signaling and communication systems, including an automatic train control system that allows trains to run closer together, improving efficiency and capacity. By comparison, the United States have been slow to adopt HSR technology, with most trains limited to speeds of around 200 km per hour or less. The United States Acela Express, which operates between Boston and Washington, D.C., has a top speed of just 240 km per hour. Number 4. Standardization and Modularization China has developed standardized and modularized designs for its railways, which can be easily replicated across different regions of the country. This has allowed construction companies to use the same designs and materials in multiple locations, reducing costs and speeding up construction times. For example, the country's HSR lines use standard gauge track, allowing trains to operate seamlessly across different lines. On the other hand, the United States have a more fragmented railway system, with different companies using different track gauges and signaling systems. This can make it more difficult to coordinate construction and operations, and can result in higher costs and longer construction times. Number 5. Economic Benefits Building railways has significant economic benefits, such as increased trade, tourism, and job creation. 
China recognizes the potential benefits of a modern, efficient railway network and has prioritized its development as a way to boost economic growth. The expansion of China's railway network has led to increased connectivity and trade between different regions of the country, as well as with neighboring countries. For example, the HSR line between Beijing and Shanghai has reduced travel time between the two cities from over 10 hours to just 4.5 hours, making it easier for people and goods to move between the two economic centers. The railway network has also helped to boost tourism, with high-speed trains connecting major tourist destinations like Beijing, Shanghai, and Xi'an. According to the China National Tourism Administration, the number of domestic tourist trips in China exceeded 5.7 billion in 2019, with railway travel accounting for a significant portion of these trips. Finally, the construction and operation of railways have created jobs and driven economic growth. According to China's Ministry of Transport, the railway sector directly employs over 3 million people, with additional jobs created in related industries like construction, engineering, and manufacturing. China's success in building railways is not only a remarkable feat of engineering, but also a testament to the country's vision for economic development. The investment in railway infrastructure has enabled China to connect its vast regions and expand trade opportunities with neighboring countries. Additionally, the country's focus on innovation and efficiency in construction has set a new benchmark for high-speed rail development worldwide. As China continues to lead the way in the railway industry, other countries may take note of the benefits of investing in modern transportation infrastructure. From reducing travel time to boosting tourism and creating jobs, the potential economic benefits of such investments are vast. It's an exciting time for the railway industry, and China's success serves as a shining example of what is possible with the right approach and dedication.